Froome's Academy of Information Technology, where the focus is on academics and high technology. Froome's Academy of Information Technology is a magnet high school in Seminole County. We serve grades 9 through 12. Fairly small in size, we have about 600 students. We have a very strong academic focus, but all of our electives are in the area of information technology. One of the first observations here is particularly striking. In the cafeteria, we see every student has a laptop computer with wireless internet access. They're with them all the time, in class, at home, and during lunch. It gives them access to just a number of different software, but in addition to that, it allows them to access assignments at home and it improves home school communication between parents and the school. It's a vital component of a learning strategy that has earned Crooms an A standing as a school and helped graduates into college and job opportunities with leading high technology companies. If you're into, you know, computers and stuff that's technological, then it would only make sense to go to Crooms. You become very prepared for college through the school because there's a lot of personal attention through the students. In this presentation, We'll look at the unique curriculum, the integration of courses which can give students a head start with college credits, as well as certifications that qualify them for high technology jobs. This is supported by Crooms' close partnership with the business community. We have a lot of IT companies that are located around the school, like UCF Research Parkway area. Anyone who has an IT company, we reach out to them and say, hey, look, we're here. This is what our focus is all about. Would you like to partner with us? You grasp almost immediately that this is different. Crooms is different than other schools. Uh, the kids are uh, much more engaged and, and much, they have a sense of pride uh, and interest. If you like technology, Crooms is like the best. They give you the latest technology to work with. It's all hands-on. You should get as much experience as you can for technology because that's where the future is heading. So the more technology that you acquire from coming here, then you're going to be off, better off in the future. Curriculum. The information and technology program is unparalleled in Florida. Crooms is affiliated with the National Academy Foundation, the National Consortium for Specialized Secondary Schools in Math, Science and Technology, Oracle Academy, Microsoft Academy, and Certified Cisco Academy. These affiliations allow Crooms students to earn certificates that can be used to join the workforce upon graduation. Of course, I took the A plus when I was in my uh, tenth grade year. Um, so far, I've been I've taken a lot in my ninth grade year. I was able to get the BST Business Systems Technology. I've taken a lot of digital design classes, digital imaging classes, learning Photoshop. Um, not so much as the web design. Like there's different areas that you can focus on: web design, building computers. At the heart of the curriculum is a rigorous academic program, which includes history, maths such as calculus and trigonometry. Sciences, English, Spanish, and Seminole County's first Chinese course. At Crooms, we go beyond the basic requirements and require our students to do four years of English, math, science, and social studies. Uh, we see the academics as the basis of everything that, that we do. We are not a vocational program. In fact, even our technology electives are high in at the college level uh, and are very difficult programs to complete. Our philosophy is that if we truly want our kids to be smart and to be the kids who are really competitive, uh, then they have to be smart users of technology. With us having everything that we need in the latest technology in science, science and technology go hand in hand anyway. So really, we are really innovative in you know, the amount of lab work we do. A number of subjects are offered as college level advanced placement or AP classes and dual enrollment for college credits. Uh, here at Crooms, we have a very extensive dual enrollment program with Seminole Community College. Uh, in addition to that, of course, we have advanced placement coursework. Our students can earn college credit that way and also can earn college credits through our tech prep program. Every classroom is equipped with projection screens and interactive smart boards. Square theta equals one. There are many technology electives available at Crooms. 
In the ninth grade, students are exposed to all of them, so they can select the courses that suit their interests. If you're into, you know, computers and stuff that's technological, then it would only make sense to go to Crooms. Even if they don't know what they want to do, we have our Intro to IT class. That's what helped me decide to go into uh, graphic design. For example, there's web design, there's networking, there's programming, there's even just digital design and publishing. Students learn how to assemble and program computers through Visual Basic, Java, and SQL. They study networking in a specially designed classroom with copper and fiber optic cable runs throughout the campus. The opportunity for creativity is, is just amazing. So the students have a chance to do what I always wanted to do. I always wanted to make movies. I always wanted to write my own music. The people who are teaching reading are not just the reading people. They're the social studies, they're the, the, the people who are learning laptop 101. They're all teaching literacy. So I'm pleased to see that you can actually integrate something that is old-fashioned like reading and not just a book into the future of technology. That just thrills me. I came here because it was different from the other high schools and I wanted some place that had smaller classrooms where you could really know your teachers. Teachers are so nice. Everyone helps out whenever you need help and you can go in in the mornings or after school and they're always here for whenever you need them. Uh, we have one of the highest trained faculties in the district. Uh, we have most of our teachers have advanced degrees that's either a master's, specialist or doctoral degree and a number of our teachers have national board certification. The Business Advisory Committee Representatives from technology-based companies provide advice and a number of business partnership services for the students. We as business advisory council members as well as other members of our companies can come in and actually give the students first-hand knowledge of what's really going on in our businesses and things that they, have to, they, they need to look forward to. Being able to contribute to how our, our future workforce is groomed is, is, is outstanding. It provides us with, with a, a voice. We also uh, work with the school to provide job shadowing opportunities for, for students as well as paid internships. These kids are the future, so there's no better time than, the, than now to, uh, to start building on that. Uh, so it's sort of a responsibility. When you walk in the hallways coming into the school here, you'll see the different banners where uh, students have won numerous awards academically. By making all these connections, the students are starting to see the wider context of what it means to not only be at a high-tech high school, but also be part of a wider high-tech community. All students residing in Seminole County who have graduated from the eighth grade are eligible to attend Crooms Academy of Information Technology. If you like the field of technology, if you like the small learning environment, if you like a facility that's a state-of-the-art facility, if you like having your own laptop and, and working one-on-one -on -one with the teachers and, and, and the faculty here, this is a place to go. This is a really good way to get started. There wasn't anything like this when I came through high school years ago. I think we have very unique and very special students. We have a wonderful faculty, very supportive principal. So it's, it's, a, big, it's a big family. Having that individualized attention for my kids especially was an asset. It proved it in their grades. Mm -hmm.